Um, can't really say much the last episode. Last episode, sad again. Uh, Lee got bit, which has actually made me kind of sad. And we are now on no time left in the last episode. If you guys want to see the special episode, get this episode. Get this. Um, I might do this all in one. I'm gonna do as much as I can today. Anyway, get this to um, let's say yeah, this video to um um get this video to let's just smash it. Get this video to ten. Get this video to five likes. And I'll definitely 100% play the 400 episodes, yeah, 400 days episode, sorry. Don't know what that's about, never played that. I didn't even hear about it until I went and looked through the episodes. But without further ado, let's get into this one. I don't know what's going to happen in this one. Um, hopefully we find Clementine. Hopefully he's not being killed by some psychomaniac person that's been following us all the way through town. It might be a parent, it might be a dad. Or something. It doesn't look like. It doesn't look like it, but it could be. Previously on The Walking Dead. Previously on The Walking Dead. What if my parents come home and I'm not there? I've got my walkie-talkie in case they try that way. I was gonna recap the whole season, hey, boys. Hey, there were some batteries in one of those boxes. Here, you can have some too. I think we should look for your parents. They always stay in the same place when they go there. The Marsh House. Yes, that's it. You didn't come into town from the railroad, did you? We gotta go! <laughs> yeah, why? Clementine? Clementine! Oh, oh. oh no, Lee. Clementine's gone. Wherever she is, I have to find her. We have a better chance of finding her if we all go together. Who's with me? We'll look for Clementine together. Hell yeah. What kind of friend would I be if I wasn't there for you now? Clementine. Hello, Lee. It's me. I'm the pedo. <laughs> <coughs> I'm the psychomaniac killer. <laughs> I think we get Clementine, we get on the boat, and we leave. This is the parts of the choices you make, the stories are told by how you play it. Okay. Vernon, oh. get out here! There doesn't have to be any trouble here. All I want is the girl. Give her back, and nobody needs to get hurt. Okay, okay, presents. Are, are you all right? Where are you, Vernon? You son of a bitch! Cody. Who is this? It's not Vernon, if that's what you're thinking. And you should really watch your tone. Clementine's fine, but if I were you, I'd choose my next words very carefully. Please don't hurt her. Please don't hurt her. And that's when it went, that's when it went, to be continued, and I was like, no! <laughs> yeah. I'm not the one who hurts people. There's an ocean of dead between you and me and her, and if I can thank God for anything anymore, it's that. Just hold on, Clementine. I'm coming for you. Don't worry, pal. We'll get her back. Fuck you, pal. How's that feeling? 
solid. Don't worry about it. It wasn't a full chomp. No, it wasn't. We don't have much time. We're about to have a lot less. We'll all make sure nothing gets in. You're still the smartest fucker out of all of us. Try to find another way out of here. This is a okay. good Just some surgical supplies. To be honest, that's horrible looking. I found the thing I was looking for. I'll have these doors open in two seconds. Five, no time left. No, oh, fuck. What do we do? Fuck. Is he alive? Shit. This is bad. Fuck. Help me move it. Okay. This has to be done. Sorry, pal. I gotta do it. Stop. He's awake. He's still bitten. So? This is about trying to save him. At the very least, buy him some time. By chopping his arm off. Do we know it works? We don't know anything. Oh, fuck. We know there's gonna be a lot of blood. There's gonna be a shitload of blood. What if he dies? Then the rest of us go after Clementine and get the hell out of Savannah. Let's do it. Maybe it'll work. It's a big risk. Yeah. We're down here with my body. Do it. Cut. It. Save him. Fuck it. Hurt. Cut this it is off. going to hurt the top caller. Seriously. Yeah. Easier when I thought he was out. Oh, Jesus. Fine. I don't want a woman. I'll go as fast I as I can. I want the best mate doing it. You got that? <laughs> Try to stay still. <laughs> oh, God. I know. I don't watch this if you're under the age of 16, I don't condone watching this. Fingers. Holy hell. Oh, 
this hurts more than you could believe. Do you think you'll be able to travel? You lost some blood. Yeah. Good. The elevator's open. Let's go. I'll bring up the rear. I don't want to bleed on anyone. Jeez. Oh, We're gonna have to go as quiet as possible and see if we can make it to an empty floor or even the roof. You think it's possible for you? Yeah. Get going. Oh, Lee, man. Hopefully I've saved him guys. You're okay Hopefully. Down there. Remember, quiet. It's no big deal. Another arm would just get in the way. Jesus Christ. Ah! Oh no help. Puh. We kinda of fucked up the puh. Remember when Savannah was empty? Those Crawford bastards did one thing right, I guess. There must be thousands of them. They didn't follow us here, did they? It sure seems like it. That's crazy. They can't track. They just roam. Is it? That fucking train wasn't exactly discreet. Clementine's out there somewhere. Gobbled up in all of that. We'll get to her, Lee. We'll do whatever we have to. Look, let's get our bearings and see if we can figure out a way to make it across town. Good? Good. I... Uh, don't think we can ignore what just happened to Lee. He lost a lot of blood down there. If you find yourself getting winded, or worse, you gotta let us know. Okay. Probably just need to go a little slower. And I know we can't afford dead weight, so... Don't treat me like I am. We won't. Now what? We get down and we find a little girl out there. Right, pal? Now... Let's get our bearings. Okay. Oh. Can't believe this is the last episode, guys. Hospital must have run out of doctors. It's an extension ladder. Use that for something. That looks like Crawford Square over there. Fuck that place. Did fix up our boat, though. We get Clementine and get right back. Make sure she wears her life jacket, okay? Something tells me she's not gonna want to. See anything? Nah, I'm just, uh... I was taking a minute, actually. Sorry, I, I know I shouldn't. 
What's going on? That's just... everything. Fuck, man. You know. I do. I'm glad I was the one who did it. I can tell myself forever that I saved him from the worst of it. Don't dwell on it. I look at where we are right now. Uh, and I can't imagine Cat and Duck and all this mess. Can't. No. No, I'm sorry. We're in a fucking hurry to get off this roof. It's it's not the time. I'm sorry. I'm okay. How many you think are wandering around underneath us right now? In the hospital? Thousands. I mean, who knows? It was full of dead before, right? Yeah. That's what I was thinking. And out there? Look at that dust. Fuck, man, who knows? There's a bell tower over there. We know what those do. Yeah. Could be part of how we get through the streets. Yeah. Any thoughts about anything else? Nah, I'm all right. Just needed to take a second. I'll keep an eye out over here. Sorry. Here's a way down. Yeah, if half the dead population of Georgia wouldn't wander in the streets down there. She walked away from whatever accident happened. And that doesn't really mean much. That's the church across the street from the mansion. River Street should be just beyond that. We need to head back that way. We'll stop off at the mansion, like you said, and make sure we didn't overlook anything. Yeah. I might have a way to clear us a path. I can make it to that bell tower. I can draw the walkers down to that side of the hospital. There'll be thousands of them. That'll thin out the streets between here, the mansion, and River Street. Even if it's just for a few minutes. What's up over here? Bell Tower. That's what's up. Hmm. Yeah. That could help. Hey. How's the leg? It's doing a lot better. Thanks for going into Crawford for me. Even if it wasn't entirely for me. Clementine, too. Uh, uh, yeah. She's tough as hell. Isn't she? Hey ho. Yeah. Hey ho. Don't worry more than you should about it. Okay? I'll see if we can make it out to that Bell Tower. Okay. Be careful, though. I don't want you going any sooner than you have to. Thanks. I think you're Clem's favorite, you know that? Really? Yeah, she's a big fan. You get away with shit I never would. We're getting her back, Lee. You know that, right? Yeah. When we get this fucker, we'll get out of sight and leave you with him. You get me? I get you. I think we're going to have to use that ladder. Whoa, you need some help with that? I got it. Damn it. Buy us some time. Draw as many as we can this way. Get down off the roof on the opposite side and bust our asses getting back to the mansion. You think you should be the one to go? My leg's feeling better. Let me do it. If we have to decide who takes a risk like this, it should be the guy who's got the least to lose. What's the worst that could happen? I get bitten again? So Good we're point. agreed then.
Why the hell are we letting the one-armed guy do all the high-risk maneuvers? Because the one-armed guy insists. Now shut up about it. That thing looks a little rickety. Maybe keep that shit to yourself next time? Yep. <laughs> I'm fine. I was wishing I had my other hand. No shit. Try to find another way out of there? Way. Tons of them! Jesus! Now get back here! I think I have to jump! There's no way back! You can make it! It ain't that far! I'm so fucked. <laughs> I'm so fucked. <laughs> oh, I nearly missed that. Good goddamn leap, pal. Let's get the hell off this roof! Yep, if I go do that. Just come the fuck on! Well, we're not coming back here after we find Clem. Who? Fuck! How could this happen? This was Vernon. You think so? Definitely. Hey guys, Lee's right. It was Vernon and that support group. No fucking way! The invalids? Their actions uh, <laughs> contradict your characterization, but yeah, the invalids. He's right. They're not invalids. They're just people. People who've been dealing with shitty situations even longer than we have. No wonder they got the jump on us. I don't give a fuck if their Make-A-Wish was a fucking boat ride! When I find them, I'm gonna rip their throats out! We would have done the same. Not like this! We wouldn't leave good people to rot! We've taken food! We've killed to survive. What's the difference? It's different! He says he feels bad about leaving Clementine behind. But the boat was an opportunity they couldn't pass up. Vernon probably planned this out the second he laid eyes on that boat. They fucked us! Omid, can you go over the fence and let us into the backyard? We shouldn't be out in the open. Yeah. This is not happening. Everything is so fucked. Clementine is still out there. So we get Clementine, and then what? We get the fuck out of cities. I'm done with cities. We go into the countryside and make a go of it. I don't want to go back out there again. Then don't. Go your own way. You're every man for himself until you and your boyfriend actually need something. You wouldn't have had a boat to lose without us. So shove it, okay? Everyone keep it together. Nothing has changed, has it? Nothing has changed? I mean immediately. We stay the course. Don't turn on each other. We can do this in the yard.
What do you think, Lee? What do we do now, without a boat? Well, I know you two are just gonna look out for number one. And number two. You know, yourself. It's not like that, man. Bullshit, it's not. That wasn't the last boat in America. The idea was sound before, and it's sound now. The mainland is done. And we have no idea what else is out there. I don't want to get us all killed on some impossible mission. It'll be better than getting eaten alone. Out there. At least Lee's thinking. You're goddamn right, we get another boat. But not here. Aren't we all missing the point right now? Clementine is the goal. That's it. Damn right. Oh the shit! Fuck? Here they come! In the house! This episode action pack, guys. They shouldn't be able to get into the backyard, right? Maybe not. We can secure this place. Krista. Search the house for weapons. On it. Kenny. Move anything you can up against the doors and windows. That's what I was thinking. Omi. What is it? Everyone, help Omi now! Lee, help! Cut their fucking arms off! There's gotta be a knife or something in there! Hurry! Take their goddamn arms off! Bang. 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 I was like, where? Now what? Shh. Everybody. We have to hide and then find a way out. Lee's right. This place is secure. We're patient and then we get going. Fuck! New plan! Get upstairs! Go! Could have gone better. Everyone okay? Lee's still bitten. Shut up. Okay. Let's get out of here and keep moving. Kid's right. We gotta keep moving. Think there's any chance we get Clem and catch up to those goddamn thieves? I don't know. Maybe. Well, we're not going out through this window. No latches, no roof access, and 30 feet straight down. Anyone have any ideas? I bet this guy would. He's got a resourceful air about him. Knock it off. Dixon Kent the Third, Industrial Mead, Krista. Just trying to lighten the fucking tone. We need solutions, not stupid jokes. I'm sorry. So, no ideas then. There's got to be another way. 
Check the floor for any other access. A vent. Anything. Or we wait for the house to clear out and stick to the high ground. <coughs> hey. You're not looking great. And you're warm. I'm okay. Don't... What did that mean? She's at the hotel, where her parents were staying. He hasn't moved her. Yet. Yeah. Yet. We need to start thinking about more than just Clementine when it comes to our... urgency. What do you mean? How do we get out of here? That's the whole point. We don't know. Okay, now your life depends on it. How do you get out of here? I don't know. I don't get it. I do. Like I said, everyone needs to keep looking for a way out, damn it! We're trapped in here! Do you think that worked? I don't know. I hope so. I think we need to have an adult conversation about what happens if Lee takes another spill. Hey, look. We could be looking at a Larry situation here. Who's Larry? It don't matter. He looks fine to me. I think it'd be best if we just worried about getting to Clem right now. We're not gonna do her any good if you've attacked us. That isn't gonna happen. How do you know that? Guys, I don't know what happened before Omid and I showed up, but we can cross this bridge when we get to it. Lee, I'm not advocating anything here, but how is this not a thing? We're all so worked up about Clementine that we're forgetting what the fuck happened to you. Oh, I'm really glad I got you looking out for me. For Clem. This is just fucking great. Relax, Lee. This is getting out of hand. You're gonna listen to me! We will get Clementine back, with or without you. Because I haven't given up everything to die because we were stupid. I'm sorry, okay? Fuck, we can't do this! We're gonna have to! that dude's face. Shut up, sweetie. Look. It's corroded to hell. What's on the other side of this wall? A 30-foot drop? No. This mansion butts up against the one next door. <gasps> this wall ain't shit. Is this really possible? Yeah, we can do this. Okay. Definitely do this. Come on, we're, we're out. Working shifts. Omid, Krista, and I. Lee, you rest. We have to work fast. <laughs> Sorry. Me too. I get it. Go sit down. I'm glad you told us when you got bitten. It would have been easy not to. Yeah. Well. I yeah, probably would have let you go alone if you hadn't told us. Which would have been a mistake. If I were you, I would have been scared shitless. I am. Uh, and when it happened? I panicked. But now I feel it inside me. Like the day before you get the flu. It's horrible. It's so weird. I keep doing a double take on your arm, expecting it to be there. I'm hoping whatever's in their bite is gone too. What do you think the odds are of that? I don't know. I know everyone's wondering. Even if it just slows down the process, I'd be happy. You don't mean that. So when we get this guy, what do you think? <laughs> We just get Clementine, that's the focus. Despite how I feel, I, I, I can't let vengeance be the thing. Sure, but if it's not that easy... We'll do whatever it takes. And, you know, whatever happens to you... Uh, I killed a motherfucker, I put a bullet between his eyes. Do not talk like forward, that. Boys. The entire time we I were at a bullet hospital, between his eyes. I could sense you think you're as good as... I was bitten, Krista. You cut it off. What good is it to plan around that working? 
What good is it for you to give up? I haven't given up. I want Kenny to look after her. Stop it. Do you hear me? Are you sure, man? You didn't see him with his family. What he'd do to protect them. We're not doing this right now. Krista, he listen to him. Uh, it's a good lad. Want, okay? All right. I'm out of gas. You look good and rested. Sure. If you don't count an infected leg. You want me to do it? Nah, hun. You can hop in after me. Shouldn't be long now. It's good we're forced to take a breath. Uh, that, uh, feeling any better? Still feels pretty recently chopped. So, no, Kenny feels about as, uh, good as you'd expect. I mean, do you think it worked? Did it, did it help at all? Well, it feels like so. a man who got bitten. So, take that for what it's worth. I still can't believe you went and got chomped. Just fucking hell. At least he told us. Took some brass. I don't think I would have. How are you? I'm... Uh, I don't know how to answer that. I'm sorry. You've lost more than anyone. It'll be all right, Ken. Why are you acting like what's happened ain't happened? Anyway, I appreciate it from both of you. A lot of us have lost families. This guy tell you much about what we've been through? Bits and pieces. The aforementioned Larry fella? See, Lee and I got trapped in a fucking meat locker with him. He had a heart attack, so there's this guy who, I should say, was built like a brick shithouse. Yeah. We're terrified he's gonna come back and eat all of us. What did you do? We were resourceful. Larry didn't make it out. No, he did not. We did, though. It's all water under the bridge. All we can do is move forward. Well, cheers. <laughs> Take it. Hello. I'm through. No walkers. Things are looking up. Way we're out, guys, we're out. Everyone keep a goddamn eye out. This place seems pretty sealed off. Well, Gotta go. Yeah. We've seen so many people. I don't know why these ones break my hey heart. Hey guys, I, uh, sorry for pausing it, but I forgot to mention this should be the last Walking Dead episode for a while. I'm gonna give it like a two to three week break before. Maybe a two week break before I bring it back. Uh, but before, you know, a week before I bring it back anyway, because I'll do 400 days. So. Yeah, I'll do the 400 days episode and you'll be expecting The Walking Dead any day after that. Any day, guys. What's heartbreaking is not giving yourself a chance. That's the episode to look out for 400 days. Jesus. I'm sorry, kid. 
She left me. A son. People that cared about us. I forgive her, but it don't make it any less wrong. You don't just end it, because it's hard. You stick it out, and you help the folks you care about. Good so point. let's figure a way out of here and get that little girl. We should move. Yeah. Got at least one shot left. Let's clear the room before we move on. Lee, figure out where we're headed. Judging by the decor of this room, I guess they were PBS watchers. Hey, my parents' house looked a lot like this. Yeah? And they watch kung fu movies. Just saying. I guess Crawford would have gotten them anyway. Good point. Hard to believe the world once felt this peaceful. It's sick, but think of all the pain they avoided. Nothing other than personal items in here. Yeah, it will be with the. It's a bedroom. Like we can stay off the streets all the way to River Street if we're careful. No, they found meth Let's in the go. bottom drawer. Uh, found meth. We found a cooking lab. We found a lot. <laughs> like a smile. I mean. <clears throat> Let's keep going. Be careful up here. They haven't learned to climb yet, right? <laughs> hey, just an always a point. Next point. Try to get to that. Who's killing You ready for whatever's coming? I got a lot of pain inside me, Lee. I'd like to get even a little bit of it out. You got that walkie-talkie? Yeah, of course I do. You might want to give him a call and tell him we're coming for him. Yeah, right. Uh, Careful cross this? here. The dive you fall down there. Shit scared we'll put a person out. River Street's just up ahead. It is. Nope. Maw of darkness full of walkers? Fuck that shit. This roof could give way. Don't gotta tell me twice. Let's keep going, you bunch of lollygaggers. <clears throat> oh, fuck. Well, I'm so sorry. We have to get it back. That's our lifeline to her. But we can find this guy without it. And what if we don't? We need every clue that comes out of it. Lee's right. What the fuck, Kenny? I'm so fucking. Let's do it. Let's, let's everyone do it. Everyone in the comments. Put it in the comments. Comment. What the fuck, Kenny? You gotta elongate everything. Fucking sorry. What the fuck, Kenny? We just need to figure out who's going down there. No, we don't. Krista! Jesus fucking Christ! I got it. Get me up. Fuck. We can't reach. Find something. Fast. Past would be good. Keep a fucking eye on her.
Grab onto this. We'll pull you up. Good. Thanks. <gasps> ah! <coughs> oh, fuck's sake. Here, baby. Let's go! Jump! <sighs> Me and my fucking mouth. Kenny! What are you doing? Get her, Ken! Can't you said all that shit and not do something now. Come on, reach! <sighs> I got you, hun! Save her! Go, go, go! Can you fucking hear me? Kenny! Get Kenny! You gotta run, man! Go! We'll find a way to get you! Oh fuck, guys. Where'd he go? Oh. F maybe, maybe he ran. Maybe, maybe the man's all right. Maybe he'll find us. What if he doesn't? Uh, cheers for that. There for you. You're watching this video. I know he did. I'll do it. Thank you. He. <sighs> that was me and my best friend. I'll be down there. I jumped down there. I've already been there. I think Kenny's dead, guys. Oh, fuck. <sighs> I my drink. I need my. I need a drink. My voice is dead. Marshall Hotel is around the corner of the block. My voice is killing me. Okay? Do you want it? Uh, Val. Kenny was my friend. He could be tough to like, but I agreed with him most of the time. So, we were assholes together, I guess. This is a shitty time. I want to make sure we're clear before we go forward. What is it? Clementine, I know Kenny was your guy. Yeah? When it comes to Clementine. Well... Well what? I'm... You guys would be great for her. Keep her safe. We do our best. You know that. Good. Thanks. Whatever Fucking your best hell, Kenny, is, man. I'll trust it. That's all you can do. The... Why did you let Kenny jump well, down there? At least it doesn't look like a death trap. Who's going first? You're the lightest. He's got a busted leg. And you're walking for two. I'm obviously not doing so hard. Decision doesn't make itself. No, oh, Kenny, I can't stop thinking. About it. I'll go first. I'll go first, in case anything happens out there. You sure? Yeah. I'm to get there for Clem. Just go nice and slow. I'll be well scared. Look at that. That's quite cool. That's a quite cool picture. 
Hopefully that can be my screenshot. My um, thumbnail. Almost the there. Rotors. It's an easy crossing. Good. Just stay here in case the video takes a picture. Uh, yeah. Shit! Oh, fuck! Shit! Are you okay? Fine. I'm kinda fucked here. What are you gonna do? Fuck it. I'm going for it! Going for it? What does that mean? It means I'm already bitten. I just have to push my way through. What the fuck? But maybe you got to it fast enough. Maybe you'll be fine. I can't risk losing more time on a long shot. Let's meet outside of town, by the train. Are you nuts? It's the only way. Do you hear me? Yeah, by the train. Jesus, we'll be there. By the train, guys. Remember that. Meet outside by the train. Ah, that's a good picture. More zombies, anyone else in the world dead? Oh, that was a clean cut. The Marsh House. Yeah, the bad people. Alright, one last thing to say before we get into the next part. Uh, you guys, I know these episodes have been long, but I'm going to try and shorten. Um, some of them have been short, some of them have been short. People have been moaning they want to see me do this whole episode in one. I'm going to try and do it all in one. But, yeah, but um, if you guys are going to play other games, I'm raveled to release, it's only like 20 minutes long. And I believe every Friday I'm going to do um, horror games, scary games. Uh, I've got Layers of Fear and... Uh, what's it called? Outlast to do. And then I'll do Outlast DLC. And then I uh, might do Outlast for it too. But if you guys want to see all that, please give, please get this video to 5 likes and I'll do all that. Cheers guys. Been amazing. Peace out. Me? Can't believe the hotel, so, um. So quiet. Yeah, oh, it's so, so quiet, man. Wait, can I turn around and lock the door? I got us adjoining rooms.
Hello. Okay. This is civil. <laughs> you look horrible. And you're missing an arm. Go over there. Make me biatch. <laughs> Actually, you make me put uh, your things down. Let me out. Who's out there? Quiet, please, sweetie. Your things there. This is all I've got, okay? You travel light. I don't believe you. That's everything. Go ahead and search me. No, I'm not touching you. Just sit down. Go away of it, guys. Do you know who I am? Yes. No. no. I don't know anything about you. You wouldn't. People like you don't. Now you're thinking, who would have it out for me, huh? Yeah. A few weeks back, there might have been a station wagon in the forest, full of all sorts of food, water, things you need to survive. Yeah. I'm not some cannibal, Lee. Some killer out in the woods. Some villain. I'm just a dad. I coach Little League. Everything was just out there for the taking. We were starving. For Did the taking? Do you know what you took from me? Don't you start on who took what from who. I didn't take her from you. I rescued her from you. Don't you get that? <sighs> Have you ever hurt somebody you care about? No. Uh. That's not true. You didn't care about that woman before holding her back so your friend could bash her dad's brains in? I hurt her. So bad. My son Adam went missing. I took him out hunting even though my wife said he was too young. I figured he had to learn. I came back without him and the look on her face said, You are a monster. Okay. Don't get this bloke, don't get this bloke. We all went out looking for him. We never found him. I hurt her so bad. Then Lily you took all of our things. You robbed us. I could have earned her trust back, Lee, but not after that. You fucked up, it's all my fault. I was like You fucked up. The hungrier we got, the more you hurt Lily. <laughs> Don't care about Lily. Our daughter Elizabeth and was that meant to um? I feel sad. They didn't get far. Don't care about Lily. Found them a day later in the road. Do I look like a monster to you? Not really. Yes. If you more like that now, like a nun. Just wait. I'm Somebody like you. Like dresses up in his mum's clothes. Was a man with a pitchfork right in front of a little girl. I did what I had to. You abandoned a defenseless, grieving woman. She deserved it. The sweatshirt she's wearing was my boy's. You stole that from us. <laughs> well, I fucked up. That's not the whole story. We were starving. It was cold. So my family starved in the cold. 
Damn, he's got a big grudge. Uh, I think the whole story will play out different if you um, don't take the food, guys. Try it. I'm going to go back and try it. You're a monster. You're a murderer and a thief. And I'm going to hurt you so bad. Try it, bitch. Doesn't have to be this way. You can't take care of anyone. After I heard Clementine on the radio and realized who you folks were, I came after you purely for revenge. But the more I heard about the things you did and the danger she was in, our plan changed. Lee, listen to me. I need you to hear this before what happens next. I can take care of her. We can have a family. I bet you don't even know how old she is. Uh, she's nine. She's eight. Wrong. She's nine. But... Her birthday was six days ago. I know how to be a dad, you know. She wouldn't be exposed to what she has been with you. That's not happening. You're crazy. Keeping her with you is crazy. You'll have to kill me. Yeah, I know. Hey, honey, I think this is all gonna work out. What are you? I'm glad too. I wish it wouldn't have had to get this bad, but it's all over, hon. Isn't it? Just about. I hate seeing you like this. I just miss your smile, honey. I miss you so much, Tess. You're gonna like hey. Clementine a lot, though. She's not Lizzie, but she's sweet. She wouldn't hurt a fly. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> Don't never take a knife to a gunfight, man. <laughs> hey, I think this is all gonna work out. What are you? I'm glad. Never take a knife to a gunfight. That is the wrong thing to do. I wish you wouldn't have had to get this bad. But grab the empty bottle, smash him on the head with it. Isn't I'll it? get in a tussle. Just get in a tussle. You get the knife and cut his head off, please, like and throw out the window. Thank you. I just or we'll play football later with it. I miss you so much, Tess. You're going to like Clementine <sighs> a lot, though. She's not Lizzie, but she's sweet. She wouldn't hurt a fly. Oh! <laughs> 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 I am Come on! He's going though. Have come back. That's right, sweet pea. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Shh. It's okay. It's oh, okay. I used to. No, no, never died. Your arm's gone. Why? So scary. I had an accident. 
we'll talk about it somewhere safe. You don't smell good. Yeah, I know. <gasps> Did he hurt you? No. Not really. I'm sorry, Lee. Clea, it's okay. Oh uh, man, this is getting sad. And then we have to talk. Man, this is getting okay. really sad. Yeah. I'm getting sad. Everything's okay now. I'm sorry, we need Lee. To out how to get out of Savannah as fast away. as we can. I'm sorry you had to see that. He was going to kill you. It take you. Yeah. Oh, that was in the bag. Jesus. Don't look in there. No, I know. Carl, let's go. Savannah. Oh no. <laughs> I think she worked it out, guys. I think this might be inspired by the actual Walking Dead. Never ever ever Clem. Got a little bit of blood Stay on it, right but next to me. Walk very slow. Oh my god. Don't look around. Neither. And don't panic. Mm -hmm. I'll keep you safe. Madness. Oh, 
Those are our parents, man. They suck. God. Free, wake up. Please don't be dead. Please, no. Free. I, I was so scared. I, I, I thought you left me. I, I, I saw my parents. Oh, clear the top, please. I know. They didn't get to you, right? No. Oh. Well, we got away. I'm crying, guys. They're dead for sure. He looks so rough, doesn't he? Look at him. Valentine, yeah. We have to get out of here as fast as we can. Well, we can't. There's thousands of them outside. We have to. I'll protect you. We'll push no, them. No, no, that's crazy. I saved you. We're safe here. I locked us in. Get that door open. I can't. Do it. He's got to get out to safety because he's going to turn, man. It was only a little open when I found it. I closed it to keep us safe. Pull on three. One, two, three. <laughs> I can't do that. I can't. I can't do this, guys. Don't say that shit and then try and make me do stuff. See? is gone because I cut it off. Why would you do that? Because I was bitten, Clem. Please, no. No. Th that's not true. Yes, it is. Yes, yeah, it is. Uh. I'm sorry, Clementine. I'm supposed to take care of you. I can't now. I oh, know. guys. Talk about, talk about, fuck it up, talk about tear me up. I think there might fuck be a way out over there. Good, good girl. Let's oh, go. Fuck, guys, talk about tear me up. Slow. I'll help you. <coughs> let, me just, let, me just, let me just sort myself out quickly. <laughs> let me just sort myself out quickly. Get composure, because that, that, bit, that bit got me, that bit got to me. That bit got to me, guys, that did. Oh, fuck it out. Got to me. I got you. You can lean on me if you have to. I'm okay. I'm okay. I thought I was helping by bringing you in here. Oh, you did, honey. It's you awful did. out there. Oh, you put a oh, me up. It was hard. Fuck it out. I don't know how you did it. <laughs> you did good. I'm on the verge of like okay. breaking down, guys. Keep I'm going. on the verge of breaking down. Like, you don't know there. how close I am. Right now. Oh, he's gonna die, guys. No, guys, he's gonna die. <laughs> I didn't want it to happen. <laughs> Get up, Lee. The door is right here. Oh, come on, Lee, you can do this. I can't. You have to. Liam, I can't move. This is it for me here. Please, please, try to get up. Oh, Clementine, please don't do this to me. I'm trying, Clem. <coughs> I can't. Clem, I can't do it. You don't have much time. You've got to do something. Fast. Uh, You're gonna have to make sure I don't turn. You won't, though. Them, no, God. I will. You know what you have to do. No. No, I can't. I this. can't. There's no way. <laughs> Go Just in the door. start by getting that door open. It's locked. It's <laughs> no big deal. It's just 
just a glass window. <laughs> Ow! Not with your hand. There's a baseball bat under the counter, Clem. You can use that. This is rough. This is bad. This is rough. Use the bat to this shut is fucking the rough. So you can reach in, okay? Okay. Watch out for <laughs> broken glass. Oh, fucking hell. Good job. Don't be afraid of him, honey. You're smart. Yes, it. You're smarter than all of them. Leave, man. Leave. Boy, out through there, Clem. I know. We'll get you in there. Don't worry. We're doing good. There's a chair over there. Grab the chair, Clem. Use it to reach in to the lock. God, this is rough, man. Open it. He's, he's trapped. This will be easy then. He's got keys. Probably to that door. And everything you'll need. There are handcuffs on the ground. Get them. Okay, Lee. Fuck it out. Fuck it out, man. Fuck it out. Put the handcuffs on me. Attach me to this. But what? Oh, go check a minute. Go check a minute. I have to take a minute. Oh. <coughs> Walking well, dead can't get any worse than this. Why? No matter what happens. <laughs> I can't watch that funny off this. Cheer me up. Uh, I don't know. Just do it, sweetie. Please? Make sure they're tight. I don't I don't want to do this. Please. You have to. It'll keep you safe. You only have to deal with him. He's trapped over there. If you're careful, you can get what you need from him. The keys. And then the gun. Yeah. Keys and the gun. Just don't be afraid. If anything gets dangerous. You're faster than he is. What should I get first? Keys. In case you have to make a run for it. <laughs> get him! Get him! Watch out! You 
you're strong, Clem. You... You can do anything. But I'm little. Fucking eight years, right now. Fucking eight years. It doesn't. You go see oh, bad God, stuff. Fucking eight years. It's okay. My parents. <coughs> it's so horrible. I, I can't imagine this would be. And now, you. Please. Please don't be one of them. Please don't become a walker. There's only one thing you can do. Oh, fuck it out. The first time I actually cried YouTube properly. Like I don't know if I can. Oh, fuck. What do I do? I had to pause that. Fuck it out. Oh. You gotta leave me. You gotta leave me. You can't okay. You'll be just like them. It's okay. It won't be me. Please. It's time to go. You gotta get out of here. Y you can come with me. No, honey. I can't. No, I can't, man. It's okay. Please. You have to go. Now. Maybe. Maybe. Maybe I shouldn't let you turn. I don't want you to have to do that. <laughs> Save the bullet. I'm not going anywhere. You have to always think about what you might need later. And Megan, the first days we met, do you remember? Yeah, I do. Get out, I got one viewer. Boy Glenn, we met a girl. No, guys, this, is, this is rough. This is come back as a walker. I couldn't bring myself to give her the gun. I didn't want to see death then. I know we've seen so much of it, but you shouldn't have to see it now. I'll go. I'll, I'll leave you. I'll you go are. as fast as I can. And as safe as you can. It's emotional still. It's emotional. Fuck. They're outside of town. By the train. By the train, Glenn. By the train, you know the train is. Yes. Good. <coughs> okay. Take good care of Both of them, Jack. Fucking hell, man up. <laughs> Fucking fuck. And Glenn. <laughs> I will. I'll cut it myself. Great. Yes, Good. man. Remember, man. Remember. And also, I'm actually, I'm actually like dying, man. Go, fuck's sake. What? What is it? No, don't worry. Fight, guys! I'm fight, I'm fight, I'm fight, I'm fight, I'm fight. Get the motion, oh fuck it out, motion, oh woo.
that the end? Is that the end? <sighs> what an end to season fucking season one, guys. What an end. What an end. Oh my god. <sighs> Face on the comment books. Yeah. What an end, guys. What an end to it. Oh. Yeah, look, 60, 62% of people tried saving Lee. You stood up for Ben in Crawford. You dropped Ben from the Bell Tower. You trusted her with your past. Um, that's thingy. You saved her life at the cost of every, of any uh, of others. She will. She was killed by Lily. Can you change that? Can you change that? Killed by Lily. You defend her against Lily's actions. You helped her onto the train. <sighs> he died with a walker attack. Yeah, guys. That was rough. You talked him down from ignoring his son's fate. You asked him to kill his son. You called him a racist, I remember that. That was, that was... <laughs> I don't know if that's copyright music. Um, what an end. What an end to a really, really, really good series. That series was amazing. Yes, I got a little bit emotional at the end. A little bit emotional, but I'll be fine. If you guys want to see 400, four, is it 400 days? If you guys want to see, actually, let's go quickly. Say it quickly, let's just see. Let's play. If you guys want to see the special episode 400 days, get this video to 5 likes and I'll definitely 100%. Play 400 days special episode. <coughs> I didn't even know that was a. I didn't even know that was a thing until I saw it on here. But yeah, guys, stay awesome. Oh, I've got two viewers now. <laughs> Welcome. I'm, I'm just about to end the stream. I'm just about to end this, guys. Um, it got emotional towards the end. If you want to see me get emotional, follow, uh, subscribe to my YouTube. It's Jet Gaming. Uh. Yeah, so it's Jet Gaming. Look for me. Look for all. Uh, and I'm the guy who does all the Walking Dead. It's my game. My uh, YouTube picture is a JG. But anyway, without further ado, don't uh, stay awesome. No, peace out. Stay awesome. And bye.